baby, don't check for me. Taking time out to be and live my life off screen. Hey guys, it's Sharika. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. Today is Friday. Happy Friday. And I am on my way to the gym. Of course. Um, y'all notice anything different behind me? <laughs> Ryan picked up the shells yesterday. Our made burgers. Oh, okay. So good. And the chair. So now I have to clean up in here because I have stuff just kind of laying around. But I'll tackle that a little bit later because I have to make room for it. So, yeah. Um, I have to go to the gym. Then I need to go to the nail salon again because I broke my nail yesterday. So, while I'm there, um, I think I'm just going to get a polish change because my nail polish is a little chipped. So, I'm just going to get this done over and this nail fixed. But I low-key like this length, so I was thinking about getting it cut this length, but then I was like, mm, no, I'm going to just get him to fix it and then do a polish change. So that is the plan for today. I'm headed to the gym, and I'll see you girls later. Y'all, guess where we at? We at Krispy Kreme Donuts, getting some donuts for our son. <laughs> Little Tony love Krispy Kreme donuts, so we're stopping at Krispy Kreme. I wonder if Hi, I should you? try their coffee. Yes, can I get a, a dozen Krispy Kreme donuts? A dozen glaze? Matter of fact, Just let me get half a dozen. Right, a half a dozen glaze? Let, let me get, get, get an ice vanilla. And let me get an ice vanilla latte. latte, please. With almond milk. Uh, almond milk, please. We don't have almond milk. Oh. Yeah. Okay, don't worry about it. Uh, then. Could you cancel that latte then? Y'all know that skin product that somebody sent me. I used it and I broke out right here. But it's cleared up now. You're so like my person it was asking for almond milk and we just don't carry it. Uh, oh, really? for real? Y'all don't carry that all dang. That's crazy. Thank you. Yeah. Alright, thank you. You, have one of the you too. Alright. Well you out uh Yuli honey boy? I make my own coffee at home. I was saying, y'all, yeah, I had broke out from that skincare that I got and I tried it and yeah, it's enough for me. So the skin is back skinning. I'll link down below some of the skincare products that I use and I also have a 25% off discount code for uh, Sunday Riley. You have to go on their website though and y'all can get 25% off. I think that link will be good until January 2024, if I'm not mistaken. So y'all use it up and save yourself some money while it's still available. So I'm gonna go ahead and make us some lunch. So thank you Every Plate for sponsoring this video. Every Plate is a meal kit service that delivers fresh, delicious, and easy to cook meals right to your doorstep. Each kit comes with the pre-measured ingredients and easy to follow recipe cards, making cooking a breeze. And with a variety of meal options to choose from, including vegetarian and family-friendly options, there's something for everyone. So I decided to go with the linguine alfredo with shrimp. I have all my ingredients here, so let's get started.
So why not try every plate for yourself and add some excitement to your meals today? Get $149 per meal by going to everyplate.com and enter my code SHARIKA149. If you guys follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and if you look at my YouTube shorts, then you guys saw this already, but I forgot to show it on my blog. So I'll pop up a little reel that I did on the side, but this is like a little birdie lemon squeeze. Everybody loves this thing. And one of you guys actually sent it to me, a video on it on Instagram. And I thought it was the cutest thing ever. Look, it's so cute. So you just put the lemon, you just put the lemon inside right here. You have to do like a lemon slice and then it'll make your lemon juice. So, so cute. And it's only like $6, I think, but I got the pack of uh, two and this one was $8. I'll link it in the description box. I can't believe I forgot to tell y'all. Now y'all know I love this. This screams Sharika B. I never made the chocolate cup of strawberries. I still have the stuff right here. So I might do that on this vlog with you guys. I probably just make six because my son been wanting to eat those strawberries. <laughs> and I told him to wait until I pick my strawberries out that I want to use for my chocolate cup of strawberries. So I'll probably do that on the vlog today because I'm not doing anything. I am going to just have a real chill day and I don't want to bore y'all so maybe I'll do that for you guys so let me take all right y'all so I am headed to the nail salon and y'all I was laying out my stuff for my chocolate covered strawberries and it just took me back if you guys are new here um, I used to have like a little um, chocolate covered strawberry business. It was something small. It all started as a hobby. Um, when I used to get like chocolate covered strawberries delivered to me, like my husband sent some to my job or something like that. And I just always thought that covered strawberries was like the prettiest thing. So being me, if you guys have followed me for a while, then y'all know like, I do it all the time with different meals and stuff like that. If I go to restaurants, I'll try to recreate it at home. It's just always been something that I've been into. And so I was like, okay, I'm gonna try to make some chocolate covered strawberries. So when I first started, girl, they looked a mess. I think I did them for my mother-in-law. And I decorated them and all of that. I did it for my sister one time. And they thought that they were cute. I thought they was cute too back then. I, I think I got a picture of my mother-in-law at our old place. I'll pop up a picture if I can find it. But, um, so I kept doing it, kept doing it, and then I got really good at it. So every time I would do some, you know, it just started off with, like, family and stuff like that. I would post it on my Facebook page. And, you know, on Facebook, it's like people you know, like people you know, closer people, right? So then my co-workers, I had like a few of my co-workers ask me to make some for their girlfriend or make some for their husband, whatever. And by this time I was pretty good. So, and then the, I would do that, then they would post them on Facebook. So I was getting more and more people asking me to do chocolate covered strawberries for them. Of course they were paying me. So then I'm like, okay, so I can make you know some little extra money on the side by doing this so then i made an instagram page so when i made the instagram page it kind of took off y'all probably even bought some chocolate cover strawberries for me and didn't know but yeah it took off on instagram so i was doing it all the time mostly on the weekend though that's when i was getting all my business so it was a big thing my business name was just berry glam so i was doing that and like I said, it turned into this big thing. So child, I, I started getting overwhelmed with it. I called myself training my mom, training Ryan, Kalila, just somebody that can help me. And child, I fired them before I even hired them, okay? <laughs> Nobody could do it right. Y'all know how I am. Like I like my stuff to look pretty. I've always been this way. Like 
before everybody was saying aesthetics and liking it i've always been like this like i've always liked my stuff to look nice i've always been into the cutesy things like always so child ain't never make it and of course tony ain't dipping no strawberries tony would just help me like put the boxes together help me clean up and stuff like that it became a whole thing a lot of y'all remember because i was at that time I started my mukbang channel, but I also started my vlog channel, so I would just vlog, set y'all up, and talk to y'all. I was up all night long, especially like during like Valentine's Day, Mother's Day, things like that. Oh my gosh, it was crazy. So after a while, I had to stop doing that because it was just, it was too much. It was too much. Like I would have to take off work like i was doing weddings birthday parties like the whole thing and like on valentine's day i would have to take off like two days to have everybody order ready for valentine's day and my job would let me do it because most of the orders was coming from them anyway <laughs> so it was a whole thing but that just brought me back and then after i did the strawberries once my co-workers found out about my mukbang channel because i didn't tell everybody about my mukbang channel i only told like maybe like two or three people knew about the mukbang channel in the beginning so once that kind of leaked out like they saw it on youtube then they wanted me to make them some seafood and i'm like oh my gosh so then i started making like seafood trays for them because they was they wanted to be greedy. They like I got the way you be eating that food. I, we gotta taste that. So I would do little seafood trays for them, but it was like only on payday, and I would only take maybe like I would probably take maybe like fifteen orders, and it was like I said, it was only on payday, and I only did that at my job. I didn't do that like outside of my job, like I did the strawberries. The strawberries, girl, I was worldwide. <laughs> it was a big thing. And I probably would have still did it because I really enjoyed it. But, um, and then I stopped that because I'm just like, it's too much. Because <laughs> then, you know, my, my, um, mukbang channel was picking up. And then it was just, it was too much for me to be trying to do all that. So, yeah. I kind of went off topic because I was supposed to be talking about the strawberries. But, girl, I had my little side hustles. <laughs> now we're here. But yeah, they were really pretty. My, I was really, really good at the chocolate covered strawberries. I used to do like, like I say, I used to do weddings, birthday parties, um, regular birthdays, Valentine's Day, Mother's Day. I used to do some for fathers. I had did some really pretty ones. I'll pop up some pictures if I could find some. Most of y'all already know if y'all were here back then, y'all know how I did. Um, my work but I'm gonna just do some regular chocolate ones today but I'm gonna still make them look cute I don't really like chocolate strawberries like that but um I'm craving something sweet so y'all already know what time that is but I'm almost at the nail salon and I popped in that little my sponsor content that was pre-recorded. I don't know if some of y'all probably was a little thrown off. Like, okay, she just left the gym and she eating pasta. That was um, something that I had to pop in because they wanted that clip to be in the first two to three minutes of the video. So I could have made it a little more seamless by popping it in like later on in the video, but they wanted it early. So yeah. Oh gosh, honey. She bent over tying her shoes with a baby stroller in the street. But yeah, tomorrow, tomorrow night, I'm gonna do like a little get together at my house. And we're gonna watch the Lifetime movie, Keisha Cole Lifetime movie. Last week, me and Ryan watched the Mary J. Blige one. It was so good. It was two, two separate movies. It was so good. I really enjoyed that. It had the dude from um, Terry from BMF. He was the guy. And then I forgot that girl's name. 
but it was really good at first i was a little confused because i'm like is this mary j Blige's story or what's going on but she just produced the movie and the keisha cole one is on keisha cole's life but she's playing as herself so that should be interesting i love me some keisha cole so i can't wait to watch that so we're gonna do something i'm trying to decide what we're gonna eat because tomorrow is date night but we'll probably do something a little early and i need to find out what time the movie comes on i gotta sneeze <coughs> oh but because i'm not doing anything later i'm gonna see if he want to just go to dinner tonight instead of tomorrow that would probably work better i'm gonna text him when i get in the shop we might go tonight just so that way tomorrow i can be home watching this movie because i don't want to miss it so we'll see all right i'm pulling up y'all i brought my camera but I forgot to put my SD card in the camera. So I can't use it. Ten minutes early, I gotta text him and let him know that I'm out here. Here's the camera Ugh, that I can't use. I still haven't been able to get the car wash because it's just been so rainy all this week. The sun is out right now, but it's supposed to rain later. Which I could still get it washed, like I said, because it's in the garage, but it's like this rain has been crazy. Alright, let me go in here. Y'all, Louie got them snipes now, y'all. He got them snipes. So if he do y'all nails, he keep the snipes in the closet. And yes, I said snipes. He keep them in the closet, so... Well, no, he keep them on top of the shelf. So, um... I'm putting some lotion on my knees. He gonna complain about this lotion on my hands, because... He hate when I have lotion on my hands. Well, my knees is a little ashy. I think I missed that when I was lotioning up. I wonder if he got somebody in his chair. This boy is sitting at this table, twisting his hair with his eyes closed. I want to show y'all so bad, but it might be one of y'all kids and I ain't trying to do that. One of y'all boyfriends. He is enjoying that twist, baby. <laughs> I want to show y'all so bad. Son, what is you doing? All right, I'm done rubbing myself down. Let me call Louie and let him know I'm outside because sometimes they lock this door he is in, what is this building called? Y'all know like one of those, um, it's just like a suite and everybody have their own room. So that's where he is. So they'll sometimes rent this space out for like receptions, like the front part. And then everybody have their own room. It's somebody in here that does nails. I think somebody does makeup. Um, you know, it's a place like that. So it doesn't have a name on the outside, but it is on Bowden Road in the plaza where the Bonos is. That's the most popular place over here. Y'all know the Bonos across the street from Pepsi. And that's where I get my nails done. But they don't leave the door unlocked because they don't want just random people walking in. So I just call him so I'm not standing there ringing the doorbell. Even though his sister is up front, she got a sweet up front. She's so cute. She does nails too. My thumbs need feel, so I'm gonna see if he could do. It's just my thumbs too. My nails grow so fast. Hey girl, you look cute. She just got off work. <laughs> she got her little uniform. 
Alright. Let me go in here. Well, let me call Lulu. Oh, my hair's still wet. Alright, y'all. Ow! Oh, my goodness. Look at my phone. My phone needs a filling in already. No, I think, I think it's okay. I don't. I want to fill in. Oh, you want to fill in? Can I get a fill in? Yeah, you Look can at get my nails. In. What happened? Can I get a fill in? Yeah, you can get a fill in. You can get a fill in. All right, fine. Where do we look? Y'all, there's the snacks. If y'all come here, y'all get some snacks from Louie. All right, y'all, I'm done. Nails are pretty. I just went ahead and got a fill-in, which I didn't really need. I needed a fill-in on my thumb. And then I was like, just fill all of it in. And then I'll come back in two weeks to get a polish change. But now it is 1.24 and I'm going to Steve Madden really quick to see if they have these sandals. Y'all know the little Hermes dupe sandals. Not the ones that I already got. I got the black and the brown ones. But the ones, I'll put the name across the screen. Y'all know I want to get the actual Hermes sandals like that. And so, I'm going to get these. Hopefully, they have my size. If they do, I'm going to get these. See how much I like them. And then if I wear them a lot, then I am going to buy. If y'all have them, y'all let me know if it's worth buying the Hermes ones. We don't have a Hermes store here. So I would have to go. I think they have one in Orlando. If not Orlando, then I would have to go to Miami and go in an actual store and try them on. I'm not going to order them online and not know how they fit with that type of money. I want to go to the actual store to buy them and get the whole experience because I've never purchased any Hermes before. So that is my plan. I've been told y'all a long time ago that I wanted to get those sandals. So I'm going to go to Steve Madden and then I might go to Nordstrom because it's this new Joe Malone candle. Well, I don't know if it's new or not, but I wanna smell it. So I might go in there and just smell that. And then I'm gonna grab a coffee from Nordstrom. And then I'm going home. Y'all know I told y'all I was gonna do the chocolate covered strawberries on this vlog. I think I'll just do like a reel. I'm gonna just do a reel or something like that. Cause I need to post a reel anyway. So I'll probably do a reel. Y'all follow me on Instagram. I am Sharika B so y'all can see it. One of you guys told me that there's a flower shop next to the Wawa. So I have to pass by there anyway. So I'm going to stop over there, see if I can find it and see if they could do me a little one too. Even though I just bought some flowers from Publix, but I still want to check them out and see know what they can do for me i like my nails i started to just get my new but i was already like one hand in so i just let him do it he did a fill in and then a complete polish change so the next time i'm just gonna get my new though all right, so I'm gonna take y'all into this little flower place. Well, if I can find it, she said next to the Wawa. Let's see. Okay, there's the Wawa. Um, hold on, let me turn up here. Where at? I see the car wash. I don't see no flower place. This thing says Wawa Scrubbies ABC Sleep Number and PGP Preferred. Oh, that's the leasing place. It's a place for lease. So I don't see no flower place. Let me get out of this. 
Girl, I think I've been bamboozled. Because I sure don't see no flower place, baby. So we gonna have, I'm going to have to look that up. Because I don't see it on that sign. So we're going to sit to the original plan. <laughs> if you're watching the video, let me know exactly where. But I'm going to Google it. So I'll probably find it before you respond. Because like I said, that is the Wawa. Unless you're talking about a different Wawa. But that's the only Wawa over here that I'm familiar with, which is, I think, the newest one over here. So, I'm going to go to Steve Madden Nordstrom in Nordstrom's Coffee Shop. Which way should I go? Bop, 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 bop. I'm going to go this way. Yeah, Nordstrom's Coffee Shop. And then... step up our shopping game because our Nordstrom we didn't have hold on let me get in the pocket our Nordstrom is not like the rest of the Nordstroms in Florida <laughs> we didn't have like high end stuff um but girl they had like YSL they had Christian Louboutin they had Chloe they have Bottega in there now like girl and I talked to the lady and I asked her I said well when y'all started carrying when I was in the bag area I was asking her like when y'all start carrying YSL so she was like it's been about a month and she was like it's more gonna put more designers in there because I nourish them I think the only thing they had in there was like Tory Burch and so it's nice to see that they're finally you know giving us some stuff because girl we would have to go i mean besides um louis vuitton was like the only thing that we had out here and this is an outside mall some of y'all think that it's like a um what do you call it um like an outlet it's not a it's not an outlet mall like it's not discounted stores y'all know like we have St. Augustine Outlet Mall. All of that stuff is like old, old stuff that's out of season, discounted prices. It's not like that out here. I've had some people ask me about that and no, you gonna pay full price. This is like a real mall, it's just outside. So I guess you can call it an outlet, but it's not outlet prices, it's real prices. <laughs> and the only thing that we had was the Louis Vuitton store. We had Coach. We have a, a actual Tory Burch store, but now we have um, Gucci. Um, we have Gucci out here. We have Louis Vuitton, and it's just so nice to see, you know, to see them bring in some more stuff. Because if you're like a girl that I'm not that into design, I like me a cute little bag or whatever. But it's nice to see what they have to offer, you know. That's probably why I never really got into designer like that. For one, I couldn't really afford it. <laughs> and for two, we don't have those type of stores. So it's not like, you know, I'm exposed to a lot because I can, I only see it like on the internet. So it's nice. I want them to get a Fendi so bad because y'all know that's my favorite. I love Fendi. So... That was just nice to see that, you know. But we don't have nothing. But if you go to like, you know, Nordstrom's anywhere else, they got everything in those stores. Loewe, Chanel, everything. Here, we have nothing. So that's nice. They're supposed to be giving us some more stuff. Especially in this area. This is like the best area it's so hot out here and i'm gonna have to park a good little ways away i'm gonna turn i have to walk i hope they have my size i really do 
I got my iced macchiato, caramel macchiato. Oh, the parking, the heat. Oh, I'm about to park right here. If I can get in. Uh -uh. I can't do it. I can't park that good. Y'all know how to parallel park. I can do it. Like It just depends. I have to have time to be able to back up and do it over because just whipping it real quick, I can't do that. <sighs> Let me drink some more of my coffee. All right, y'all. I am sweating. It's so hot out here. That's one of the reasons why during the summertime, baby, I'm in the house. If the sun out, uh, -uh. It, it gets so hot. Wow. It's saying 87 degrees. It feel like it's in the 90s. But they didn't have the black ones. But I still wanted to try a pair on so I can know what size to order. And um, she only had a nine and a half and a 11 which i would have ordered a 10 in that side in that style just because oh this little kid um the 11 was really big i didn't even try on the nine and a half um because i want the shoe to fit comfortable okay y'all i'm back home because my phone died in the car but I wanted to show y'all this little hat that I got from Amazon. It's so cute. I always have the toughest time finding like the whole full hat because I got a big head. And nobody ever has the extra large or the large hats. So I decided to buy this one. I think it's so cute. I found some of these in Target, but I don't really like the way that they look. Um, because I'm telling y'all, girl, I be needing these hats. This one is really cute. Just order one first to see how I like it. And I really do like this. I like this a lot. I think it's so cute. Let me put on a pair of shades. Just to see if we can catch a bag. Can y'all imagine me posing like this? <laughs> These are so cute. But um, yeah, I like this hat a lot. Let me show y'all the ones I bought from Target. So I bought two from Target a while ago and I already popped the tags off so I can't take them back and I don't really like them. Um, see because I'm, I don't like the floppy hats like that. I don't, I don't really, that's not my thing. So I would like it to have a little more structure and this one is just flop around. So, I don't know what I'm going to do with these hats. If y'all want them, somebody hit me up, girl. I send them to I love this one. So, I think I'm going to get the other two colors. I want to say, if my camera will uh, lighten up. I want to say they had black and then like a chocolate brown. I want them all. So, I can have options. But this is going to look really cute to wear mm -mm -mm. it's really cute so i'm gonna go ahead and end the video here i hope you guys enjoy hanging out with me don't forget to like share and subscribe follow me on instagram i am sharika b and i'll see you guys on the next one
Don't take it oh. personal. I ain't lying. I ain't hiding. I've been grinding, multiplying. I've been trying to get my weight up, staying prayed up, meditating and taking time away.